seems like they're more frequent and more serious this year. Four times as frequent. The New Mexico Poison Center says it has received significantly more carbon monoxide cases. We've noticed at the Poison Center that we're getting more calls this first week of December compared to any previous year regarding carbon monoxide exposures. Smolinski says a possible explanation for the increase could be people waiting to turn on their heaters this week. Carbon monoxide is made anytime there's not a full burn of a fuel source, and the older your stove or furnace is, the more at risk you are. It's a colorless, odorless gas, so difficult for someone at home to realize that it's there. From December 1st through 7th, the Poison Center got 28 calls from hospitals with patients showing poisoning symptoms. In that same time, the center got six calls last year. It can be deadly. You can die from it very very easily. Inhaling the poisonous fumes may cause headache, fatigue, and an upset stomach. It's very difficult even for an emergency department physician to diagnose because the symptoms seem like they're just the common cold or flu. The New Mexico Poison Center says someone has already died this year from poisoning. Experts recommend getting carbon monoxide monitors and having old heating appliances inspected yearly. In Albuquerque, Chris Guardaro, KYT Action 7 News.